guys, it's BB here, and I'm going to be talking to you guys about hermit crabs. Essentials for them. You seriously need water and food for any animal, but we'll just be talking about the hermit crab specifically. Right now, I am with my dear friend and my pet, Bob. Here he is. He is a Caribbean hermit crab, and the way you can tell that is because of his purple giant claw. Now, I don't really want to mess with him right now because he's still in his nighttime era because during night, he's actually nocturnal, which means that he comes out at night. And right now, since the lamp's on, he doesn't know that it's nighttime, so he's still up in his shell. We'll be talking about water first. Water. I love it. You may love it. Hermit crabs, most of the time, will love water. Now, you're going to need normal water. And it's pretty simple. You just buy a container from the pet store, fill it up with water, and put it in their container, really. Also, you're going to somewhat need salt water. I prefer to have salt water, and it's pretty cheap for the amount you get. You just follow the instructions with the salt water kit that you have. This is um, one that I got from the pet store, like local pet store. It's just salt water conditioner, and you just follow the instructions. Mine was only like a tablespoon for a whole cup, so I had to put it in this jar, and we have a, a little bit left, but it doesn't even look like salt water. You just got to know the difference between the two. And um, you're going to want that to be put in a separate container because you don't want them to be mixed around. The salt water is more like putting vitamins into a shell and making it nice, pretty, and all in all, just making him live longer and have a happier life. Water is just essential. <laughs> I don't know where the myth came from where you needed a sponge for survival for the hermit crabs. I literally was like, ugh. In the wild, they literally don't have any sponges, okay? Have you ever seen a stray sponge just there? Never, never, never have I ever seen a sponge anywhere outside of, like, really anywhere that's not society. Now, um... Now, anyways, um, yeah, just basically the, the sponges are not needed. They are literally tree hermit crabs. That's, hermit crabs literally live in the trees. The only time you'll ever see them at the beach is when they're mating or they're finding a new shell. Normally, though, the shells that they find are in trees or around the tree bottom ground. But they climb up to escape from the predators on the bottom. I don't know why they do that because it's more like your predators are in the sky because of birds. But it's their logic, not ours. We can't judge it. Well, we can, but like, I don't think they'd like that. Food. Food for hermit crabs are also very essential. You're going to want protein in it, but you don't want a straight up protein diet unless your hermit crab is like super skinny or something which I would never be able to tell so you probably wouldn't either um anyways hermit crab food this is what it should look like I had food at one point I didn't know at that time but it looked like fish flakes I'm not kidding it looked exactly like fish flakes and it was super cheap too um, but this is about $3, and it's pretty good price, actually, for hermit crab food. Now, <laughs> literally, the fish flakes will be terrible for your hermit crab's health. These are what you need to get. They're more like pebble-shaped, and you need to put them bi-monthly, freeze them for 24 hours at minimum. It contains mixed organic grains, coconut meal, seaweed, mangrove sap, trace elements contents are balanced for proper development of cuticle skins during molting molting is when, sort of like hibernation for hermit crabs but you definitely don't want to touch them during that time um yeah and it has 24 percent 
crude protein, which is perfect because you don't want too much protein, but you also want protein in their diet. Um, also about this, this is called Gardener's Hermit Crab Food. I'll repeat that again. Gardener's Hermit Crab Food. And, um, yeah, I've been with this for, I think, over a year now. And it's, <laughs> my hermit crabs are way more active than they've ever been. It's just, they love this food, really. <laughs> I'm not kidding. This food is just, like, perfect for them. So that's all the tips for hermit crabs for now. But if you guys want to learn more about hermit crabs or you have a hermit crab and you want to learn more about them, I will make some more videos. I would just love to know what you guys want to see. And just comment down below to tell me what you guys want me to be talking about. If you want me to go ahead and do an All My Pets videos or what. Now... Also, I would love it if you guys would smash that like button. It really, it just, it just knows that I, that you guys care. You guys care about animals and nature and the environment and Bob. <laughs> so, yeah, just smash that like button. And, yeah. What's up, Seal?